So to replace the battery on the Hex Wasp, obviously make sure your gun's clear, but we're gonna take this T10 Torx and we're gonna undo these two bolts. Okay, so now that's off. Okay, so to pull this battery out, I like to take a small little screwdriver and not where the contact is over here, but on this other side. Just gonna pry that up. She'll pop right out. And take our new battery and just put it back in the way that it came out. And then you should be able to see the little dot. There you go. These screws already have thread locker applied to them. Um, it's that blue stuff that just comes on screws. So now we're gonna redo these up to 15 inch pounds. Okay, so I got a finger tight now. I'm gonna take my torque wrench. There we go, 15 inch pounds there. Okay, 15 inch pounds there. Okay, to recite this in, you'll need a 1.5 millimeter Allen head elevation and your windage over here on the right. You're gonna adjust it. And what I find useful is to look down the irons, um, just down there, and then I cover up the red dot just, just enough so I can see uh, through my irons so they're lined up perfectly. And when you cover up this red dot, it will dim automatically because it thinks that you went into like a dark building or something like that. And then you can line up the irons and then uncover it. And then you'll see if the red dot is perfectly in the right spot. That's just how I do it. There's a lot of ways to skin a cat, but that's how I do it. So I, I have that set up just perfectly right now. So I look down the irons and then I uncover it. And my red dot is perfectly at the top of my front sight. So it's good to go and sight it in. And that's how you change your battery and re it in. And you're good to go.